Hello everybody and welcome to Autovox Plays The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. We're gonna do more challenge runs right now. I'm just gonna go down the list and we got when life gives you lemons, what do you do? You throw them back at life and say, fuck you, I don't want your lemons. Anyway, um, the seed for this is B77L0LL1. Duplicates, weird. Anyway, so we're starting off with Nun's Habits. They don't got an item room. We have to go to Mom. We have Lemon Party. Uh, nine volts in. Um, yeah. So this should be freaking easy, from what I can guess. Like, like ridiculously easy. Oh, excuse me. One second. I forgot to put missing HUD on. There we go. Anyway, yes, I am feeling very good. Thank you for asking. Hypothetical straw man that I just made up. We need to come up with a name for this hypothetical straw man. It's a good straw man name. Um, Jimmy? Jimmy or Jeff? Anything with a J. I mean, I, I hate to throw friends that I have who have J's as as their name, like Jeremy. Already spoke in class today. Jeremy spoke in class yesterday. Anyway, um, yeah, today's going freaking fine. It's like the most extraordinary um, amount of ordinary I could ever ask for. Did more rec I actually recorded a game that I haven't played in a long freaking time um, for a variety of reasons. Well, the reason I haven't played it for a variety of reasons is laziness. I'm just going to own up to it. Laziness, that's really it. That's the only reason why I haven't played Legend of Grimrock. <laughs> um, getting distracted with other games. But anyway, we're back to recording it, and I just did like four episodes today. Um, so that's pretty sweet. Uh, are we on Burning or burning Basement 1? I don't feel too bad about going into the curse room. Um, I think the nickel is enough to make it worth going in here for. Alrighty. We already have like three keys, so that's pretty sweet. And we got the world. 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 The stars. Unfortunately, that actually doesn't do anything for us because there are no, there are no item rooms on this run. So we'll go in here and just get that. That's fine. It saved us. Uh, a red heart, I guess. We didn't really gain too much out of that besides just a bunch of money. Uh, speaking of which, we'll actually go in here see if we can buy a no spirit heart. Never mind. Scratch that idea. Everything I said. Shut it down. Shut it down. Shut it all down. Ah, uh, shit farts. Let's go back and see if we actually can get a bomb. Hopefully we can get a spirit heart from this area. I know we should technically be using lemon mishap just because it has a one room charge and there is a bomb, so let's pick this up. Um, but... I forget to use it. Oh, baby, yes please. Alright, Femin. Oh, I feel kind of dumb actually for using all those bombs now. Uh... It's a little scary just because of the fact that we have no way to protect our deal with the devil prospects on the next floor. It's not that it's strictly necessary to win a run, it just... You don't need a drink to have fun, but it damn well helps, is basically my philosophy when it comes to getting a deal with the devil. Oh goodness, he exploded in a rather inopportune moment, but we managed to get out there pretty much unscathed. Alright, so he should be dead momentarily. And it doesn't matter what he gives us, as long as he gives us something. So no bombs, let's go down to the next floor. Alrighty. <sighs> Hopefully we actually don't get hit. Well, this is a very easy room, so that's pretty sweet. And... Unfortunately, we won't be able to get an arcade on this floor, just because of the fact that we came down with only four cents, just one shy. <laughs> that was actually rather good. Sweet! Well, that was a really good use of Lemon Mishap. And we got some more money, that's fine. I'll go in the shop. And hopefully get a spirit heart. No spirit heart. Boo. 
That sucks. Um, I assume that the secret room is here. And it is? Just a bunch more bombs. Hopefully we actually can find a tinted rock on this floor before we actually get to the boss. We don't need to buy that, so let's ignore that for now. Okay. Alrighty! Mm. Oh yes, please. So we will go here. And we will actually blow up. That's yes. So I don't feel too bad about actually blowing up this while using our key to get to this area because we don't one, we don't have the Um there are no item rooms, so we don't need to use our keys for anything other than the shop. And um look at that. We already got two spirit hearts, so our deal with the devil prospects are more or less guaranteed. As long as we don't take like four hits. Uh four hits should be relative should be basically impossible, even for me. I mean, I'm not that bad. And... Oh, fuck. Uh... Thank you. Alright, we got the tears up. And health up. My shadow is pretty shit. It's a atrocious item, but we'll pick it up just for the sole purpose of actually getting deal with the devil precedent, and only for that reason. If I had the... Uh, if I had it my way, um, I wouldn't have picked it up, but whatever. It's fine. Okay, cool. so we are on caves. Just regular caves? Yeah, just caves one. I feel like I haven't said that in a long time. Usually we get like catacombs or freaking flooded caves. And flooded caves is annoying because of these stupid black silkworms. I guess we'll, we will blow this up. So you have an excess amount of bombs. Broken on, get 20% chance to respawn as Blue Baby. So if we die, we have one fifth of a chance to actually respawn and hopefully beat it as Blue Baby. It's like a really bad version of the Ankh. Alright, kill the spawner. Come on, spawner, you need to die. Thank you. So we got what's in the sack? Just. A bomb and a key. You know, that's fine. If we actually run into any sort of golden chest action, then we will obviously be using it. Mm, actually, better yet, it might be in our best interest to actually use this on the shop, because we do have 18 cents right now. Uh... Yay. Come on, thank you. Thank you. Pick this up. Just dodge around. Dodge around. Unfortunately, there aren't any tinted rocks in this area. Oh, this is a library. Data judgments. Um, let's honestly just blow them up. Oh, well, played them once. Stars, judgments. Yeah, we'll rock the other judgment for now. And now our here's our. That's pretty useless for us. Yeah, we're not gonna pick that up. It's useless because we don't have any item rooms, and it's an I it's a it's an item that lets us get more options. Well, another item appearing in an item room, so we can't take advantage of it if there are no item rooms to use, right? If it was theirs options, then that'd be better. But eh, whatever, it's fine. We could be cheeky and go back and get. The hangman kind of, I think I will, just because of the fact that we got an eternal heart there. And there is a golden chest, so that's fine for us to... I think it's worth to go back and get that stuff. Let's pick this up. Oh, absolutely. Now it's worth. Hmm. Super magnets. Yeah, you know what? This is fine. It draws in enemies and... Uh, consumables, but you know what? That should be okay for us to handle. And if it gets really, really bad, then we can just drop it. Okay. Thank you. Alright, Forsaken. Forsaken's kind of bad, just because of the fact that we can't actually hit him relatively, like, easily, or at all, with any of our, like, lemon mishap stuff. Uh... Oh 
Come on, come on, come on, come on. Thank you. Torn photo, you know this is fine. We're just gonna drop Super Magnet right now because it's more annoying than anything else. And we have max fire rates for right now, unless we actually lower our tier delay, but I don't think that should be that bad much of an issue. Oh, huh, interesting. So we kind of got jack shit from this room. I mean, we got a key and a nickel, but I don't think it was necessarily worth the double key usage. Oh my gosh, so much money, what the heck? Random for a nickel to drop, but all right. I ain't complaining, I ain't complaining. It's actually kind of bad that we got hit, just because of the fact that it charmed enemies away from our lemon mishap. Alrighty. Nice. Got them through a choke, and it worked out for us. Speak! EXPLOSIVE DIARRHEA! I've never actually heard him say that. Well, I've heard him, like, say explosive diarrhea, but I've never actually listened. And you know that kind of feeling when you actually... I, make, I don't know, it make, might make me seem like an asshole, but sometimes a lot of people just say shit that isn't really important. You just, you're hearing it, but you're not really paying attention. Because sometimes just people talk about dumb shit a lot, and look at me! I ain't, I'm not saying I'm, I'm an exception, I'm saying that this is just something that everyone else does. Well, not everyone else, everyone does. Even me. Is it a fault? Uh, not necessarily. Is it something that everyone else does? Yes, it is. Hangman. Hmm. Let's go in here, hopefully. We can get something from the shop, unfortunately not. There is a tinted rock, so hopefully it does contain- No! Ah, uh, boo. That sucks. Oh god. Max, did you fart? This smells. It's disgusting. He still has a- okay. It's been a few days since I actually recorded a couple of episodes, but he has been- he's still been pretty gassy, and it smells so fucking bad. Max, come on. He's just like looking at me like, what? What did I do? It's like, you know damn well what you did. Hmm. Oh my god, it smells so bad. It's like something crawled up your ass and died, bud. Oh god, okay. Come on. Alright, manage to dodge around this guy. Come on. And... Dodge around. This room is next to impossible if you don't have any actual range. I remember once I picked up like number one and um I think it's dead onion. I just could not reach him on the other side. Thank you. It's unfortunate that we weren't able to get a deal with the devil, but uh eh, whatever. It's fine. Let's get on to the next floor. Okay, so we're on Necro 1. And I think we're rocking 4 HP. I don't even want to... What the fuck? So many masks. I really don't like masks. Especially if I don't have any piercing shots. Because it makes them really, really annoying to deal with. Thank you. Alright, boom. Hopefully we're actually going the right direction. Uh, 
That was actually kind of good. Thank you for the spirit heart. Ah. Alright, so, oh yeah, another thing that I actually have been doing. So, I haven't read a book in a long fucking time. I mean, I've read, like, textbooks, but that's, that's like, reading for fun. Uh, but the last book I probably read was Into the Wild. Actually, no, scratch that. It was Of Mice and Men. It was just a bit of light reading to pass the time when I was hanging out in Tucson. Don't lose the spirit heart. Alright. Um, but, so, in order to get my brother's girlfriend off my back, um, she is getting me to read the... <laughs> The seventh book of Harry Potter, so the Deathly Hollows. I've actually never read the the Deathly Hollows. I've the funny thing is also is that I've actually read all of the Harry Potter books, the one through six, but I've never actually read the last one. Again, because I've been lazy, I guess. I know enough about what happens from Osmosis that I feel like I've basically read the book. It's like, it's like going to Wikipedia and reading the synopsis of it, and like, alright, I read it. Alright, goodbye, deal with the devil chance, rip. I have no idea how this thing spawned on top of me, but alright. Fair enough. Now whatever, I'm not gonna go, go back to pick up that extra penny. We walked all the way down here, just to get to a self-sacrifice room. It's supposed to lead me to the boss, what the heck? Alright, let's pick this up. And in all honesty, even though we shouldn't be getting a deal with the devil, um, we should be fine. Even though I haven't done the most amazing job of actually dodging, we should be completely fine to actually complete the challenge. Um, as long as we can get mom to walk into the lemon mishap and just dodge around her shit, then we should be fine. Thank you for actually standing on Lemon Mishap. That actually made it super, super easy. I doubt we're going to get a deal with the devil, but if we could, never mind. Four Spirit Hearts. It's kind of a moot point whether or not we actually get a deal with the devil on this, on the next run. Wait, well, next run? Next room? Next floor. Because we're basically done with the run at this point. Alright. Let's dodge around. Thank you. Oh yeah, um, it's, and I am in, oh, so anyway, back to Deathly Hollows. I'm enjoying it so far, um, basically, anytime I have to go to the bathroom, I take it in there, or like, go before I have to go to bed, uh, I'm uploading a video, I just, you know, just read it, read a little bit of it, and it's okay, I'm like 160 pages in after reading for like a day or two. Um, no, not all of it was done on the toilet. Thankfully, actually. It was... before going to bed and also in the morning when I'm reading my... Um, when I'm re yeah, when I'm reading my coffee. Um, when I'm drinking my coffee. While I'm like watching a Ultimate Chicken Horse or Isaac video, some just something in the background. And then have that just reading. Or while I'm driving, just do a bit of light reading while I'm driving, or be taking a swim, just pull the book out, just start swimming. I'm being facetious, obviously. Oh, that was made apparent. Okay, come on. These are pretty damn tanky. Let's do it, Mom. Alright, stomp on me. Yeah, we'll be fine. We don't even need the lemon mishap. It's annoying that we actually couldn't get it. And we'll just run the Cuban meat into her damn foot, so. I need you to stomp down, mother. Thank you. Good bit of damage. I would dare say that that was a sexy amount of damage. Alright, you're dead. 
And we did it. Let's check out what we got in our deal with the devil. Absolute shit. Okay. Bam. Alright, so much P. Let's see what we got in here for lulls. Odd leaf and BBF. Not worth it. More bombs, anyway, whatever. Let's pick this up. And we are done when life gives you lemons. We get a card against humanity. It's a room full of poop. Anyway, if you like the video, please hit the like button. It helps out a great deal. And, of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.